in the Castellameris War between the Italian-American gangs in the city. Rica's fame and power grew even after the National Crime Syndicate was founded in 1931. Frank the Enforcer Nitti took over as the official successor when Capone was found guilty of tax evasion in 1931 and given an 11-year prison sentence. Rica continued to act as the public face. However, crime historian Carl C. Fakis asserts that Rica held the organization's ultimate power, frequently overriding Nitti's directives with a firm, we'll do it this way. Additionally, authorities like Lucky Luciano only worked with Rica and not Nitti. Outside the Chicago Congress Hotel in April 1932, Rica and other notable Chicago criminals joined the arrest of Luciano, Meyer Lansky, and other famous East Coast gangsters. Despite the fact that everyone was freed without being charged, this meeting brought home how much the New York Mafia trusted Rica to lead the Chicago mob. Rica was as vicious as any crime boss, despite his soft-spoken attitude, and was renowned for giving orders like, Make him